again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 16th of January, 2019. You really want to do a search on this. It's posted on the Daily Wire, published on the 15th of January. The link's too large for me to attach. The title, Britain's First Transgender Family Now Transitioning Their Five-Year-Old Son to Female. Written by Amanda Prestigiacoma, that's P-R-E-S-T-I-G-I-A-C-O-M-O. A family dubbed Britain's first transgender family has announced that they are encouraging the gender transition of their five-year-old son, Jaden. According to the family, Jaden, a biological man, likes, dresses, and hates everything about being a boy. The little boy's stepdad, and stepdad's in exclamation marks, Greg Rogers, is a 27-year-old biological female who now identifies as a male. The child's mother is a 21-year-old woman named Jody. You want to take a look at the photograph of these two freaks. This uh, Greg Rogers has a beard <laughs> and a mustache absolutely sickening. I don't know even how this woman got pregnant. She is one horrible looking woman. The boy, a very attractive little boy and I feel so sorry for him. Both Jody and Greg are furious that concerned citizens referred to as trolls by many UK based outlets have reported them to social services for apparent child abuse. A lot of good that's going to do. The couple, however, maintained Jaden, who is on track to medically transition in a few years, is properly cared for. We've had people saying we're using Hayden for attention and that she just wants to be a girl because I changed sex. First of all, you idiot. Jaden's not a she. Jaden's still a he. Greg told the Daily Record, it's ridiculous. Jason knows nothing about my past. She just knows me as dad. Once again, it's not a she, you moron. Greg claims their five-year-old son is adamant she is a girl, citing the boy's affinity for dressing up as a princess from the popular Disney film Frozen. What's that tell you about Disney, huh? Quote, they say it's cruel. We let her wear a dress. It's not a her, it's a he. But it's not more cruel to do nothing when you've got a kid who's so adamant she's a girl. He's a boy. She's ripping her, his hair off and banging her, his head off the walls, says Greg. Greg's the freak woman that transitioned. I wonder if he's got a plastic penis. The social workers called the Rogers home have yet to act against the boy's parents, said Jody. They see Jaden is well looked after and have no concerns, she claimed. Really? So calling a boy she and calling him her doesn't cause any concerns for social services, huh? Maybe you need to get new social services. Jaden told his parents he wanted to be a girl soon after a corrective hearing operation, the parents claimed. She, not she, he, developed speech and immediately started saying, I hate wearing boys' clothes and everything about being a boy, said Greg. Really? <laughs> How come you like it so much, huh? How come you like transitioning from a woman to a guy, huh? You sick, mentally degenerate. The couple claimed they thought it was probably just a phase at first. But change your minds because the behavior has been consistent ever since. She is adamant she's a girl. Actually, he is adamant he's a girl. Jody told the outlet, all we want is Jaden to be happy and proud of who she is. It's not a she, it's a he. Whatever that might be. Jody and Greg have signed Jaden up for Young People's Gender Service, where he will receive related counseling. 
See, they don't even know what the hell they're talking about. They call him a he, a she, a he, a she, he, 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 she, they, he, he. And now, again, where he will receive gender-related counseling. The five-year-old is too young to receive hormone treatment now, but can in a few years. Noted heart.com. And you'll see a picture of these two freaks, this bloated whale and this freak with a beard and a mustache. And uh, you'll see this little boy that's being destroyed. As reported by the Daily Wire in February, parents actually lost custody of their child for refusing to encourage a gender transition. Ohio parents were denied custody of their daughter for not being supportive enough for her alleged transitionism. The 17-year-old biologically female child that identifies as a boy and claims she has suicidal thoughts over her parents' lack of support for her transgenderism. They won't, for example, call her by her new chosen male name. The parents were fighting for custody of their daughter back from the state in an effort to stop potential transgender hormone treatment. Looks like Ohio's as fucked up as the UK, huh? None of this would be going on if it wasn't for that freak, Big Mike, and Obama pushing through gay marriage. These people are out of their fucking minds. Sorry for swearing, but it makes me sick. Do a search, find that article, take a look at these freaks. Ask yourself, what's wrong with this country? Answer, probably everything. It's turning into a real shithole. You might want to repost this in all your social media accounts, pass it along to like-minded friends, ask them to do the same. Thanks for listening.